Somebody told me that they wanted to see a van tour from me, even in the condition that my van is currently in, which is not the best. I don't really know what I'm doing, and I'm a little bit afraid. The only things that I've done to it so far is take down this partition, which was super inconvenient. I had to get out and walk around and get into the back from the side door, which exposes me, right? And I don't want people to see that I might be living in here. I don't want people to really see me at all. Also, it was super terrifying to be in the back cargo space, not knowing what was going on outside of me. There's no windows. So whenever I would open the door in the morning, I wouldn't know what I was opening the door to. I know that a vehicle like this might be targeted and I can't see. So the partition sucked and I was really eager to take it down. I was like, let's take this thing out, please. That's what she said. It's so much better now that it's down. I'm actually able to access the back without getting out. However, I unfortunately have three seats, which I don't care to have, and I will eventually get rid of that and just have two. So what I've been doing in the meantime is just crawling over these seats right here. I don't know how that sounds to you guys, but it's not the most fun thing for me. I mean, it's okay, I'll live, but I long await the day when I can just walk right through here. <laughs> uh, I don't even hang out with that many people that I need three seats. That's, that's kind of not true, but also kind of is. So my van right now, I have some super fancy drawers to organize my belongings. So it just looks like a mess. I just have boxes of food, my totes from my Honda Civic trunk that had my food and camping stuff. I have really snazzy hooks holding up some of my belongings on the walls so that I can have more floor space and a little more organization. And then I have a super comfy four inch sleeping mat by UST. It's actually a camping mat and it's perfect for me for this situation. The only changes I've made to the van aside from ripping the partition out is ripping out some of these black, I don't even know what to call them. They're kind of plastic coverings on the walls and I'm not completely done with that yet. I just took down parts of the bottom halves of the walls and I put some kill mat on a single wheel well. That was just spontaneously done. I wasn't trying to have a productive day, which is why it's kind of half-ass work. I haven't really began to do anything major to the van just because I I think I'm procrastinating because I don't really know what I'm doing and I'm a little bit afraid and I kind of don't know where to start. This is the first time I'm admitting this to myself. I'm just now realizing that I've totally been procrastinating. <sighs> I'll show you guys what I plan on doing with the build. I have a little sketch. I don't have a time frame of when I'm looking to get this done. The sooner the better, but it's also just a little old me, so we'll see how it goes. Probably a lot of my upcoming videos are going to be all about this build and how that's going and how my life is looking in this space. It is very different from living in my car. Ugh, I cannot wait. It's been years since I have had space to stand up in, since I've been able to host anyone. I am dying to have people over. If you'd like to see that progression of how this build goes, subscribe. And if you don't want to, I don't blame you. So, you know, do whatever you want to do. I should mention, I'm gonna be on a TV show called Gutted. It's also an event that you're able to attend. It's called Gutted Festival. It's in Missouri in October. That is when and where we'll be filming. And funnily enough, I'll be a part of a team of seven people building out a van in five days time will i be the most useless person on that team probably probably but somebody has to be and i'm happy to take on a role 
So that's what I'll be doing. I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm also kind of like, fuck it, you know. A lot of crazy things have happened to me at this point, so whatever. All right, that's it for me. That's it. I'll show you guys what I intend on doing with the van, what I expect the build. I, the older I get, the less I can talk. It's so hot. Is that just me? <sighs> One of these days, outros will be less awkward for me, or maybe they never will, and I'm okay with that. I kind of enjoy the awkward, haphazard vibe of my videos anyway, so hopefully it never gets better, you know? That's my motto. All right, I gotta go. <laughs> Goodbye. All right, let me stop. See you guys later.